Hey guys, it is Christy K, and I'm here with you with a tutorial from the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette, this joint right here. I was fortunate enough to go to the store today to pick this up, and then I got a chance to meet Jaclyn Hill also, and guess what? She signed my palette. She's probably one of the nicest, sweetest people ever. Um, the line outside was ridiculously long. I had planned on ordering it online, but they sold out like within 45 minutes. So I went down there, it was hot as shit. And um, like Morphe was really cool. Like they gave us lippies um, and they gave us water. And then Jacqueline Hill drove by as we were going into the store, you know? But we expected her to come in, but she never did. So after I got my palette and stuff and I went outside, um, she was standing outside, like, and she was just like, oh my God, you know what? Um, it's hot as hell out here. You guys are standing out here for my palette. I appreciate you guys so much. I just want to come hug everybody, take pictures of people, sign their palettes. She's super, super, super sweet. And that's why I will always support her. Um, this palette did not disappoint. There was a thing in there with um, all the shades. These are the shades here. But I think I lost it. It may have fell out today while I was waiting. And I think when I opened it for her to sign it, it may have fell out because I honestly don't have one, you guys. Um, but this is the look that I created with the palette. Because we're in the theme of Jaclyn Hill, I pulled out my old Becca one and I, you know, used some of her highlighters and stuff. Um, I kept it like a peachy tone because I'm wearing peach tonight and um, it just kind of matched my outfit. So if you guys want this look and you want to see how I got this, keep watching. I'm going to start with taking MFEO and putting that all over my crease. I'm going to be layering that color with Pukey to intensify the deepness of the color. And because I want it to be really bold, I'm going to take Hunt and I'm going to kind of like halo it and then blend it around the edges so that it blends in with everything else. going to take the peachy tone little lady and apply it all over with my fingertips. Then I'm just blending it in so that they go together. I'm using the color Silk Cream as my brow bone highlight. Then I'm just taking a fluffy brush and blending it in so it's a smooth transition. Taking my Marc Jacobs highliner in the color Blacker, I am going to line my eyelids with that. I'm also taking the shade Row, it's like a golden brown shade, and I'm lining the lower parts of my eyes. Because I felt like the eyes need a little bit more smokiness, I'm taking the color Chip and just putting it in my outer V. Just grabbing a blending brush and just blending some more. I'm taking the color Hunt and applying it for more smokiness. Then I'm going in with the shade Firework to kind of smooth it out a little bit. Then I'm going in with the color Obsessed to open up my tear ducts. I'm taking the shade Abyss to just kind of wing out the eyeliner a little bit and go over the highlighter that I applied already. Just taking some mascara and running it over my bottom lashes. And I'm going to apply my lashes off camera. They are the Morphe Hollywood Hills. Since we're in the spirit of Jaclyn Hill, I figured I'd keep it going. I'm using her Becca palette and I'm taking the color Amaretto and putting it all over my cheeks for my blush. Also taking some Fix Plus and my Morphe M310, which Jaclyn put me up on and applying Champagne Pop so these cheeks can be popping. And when you thought the glow was over, more Fix Plus and I'm taking Obsessed and applying it on top my highlighter to make it bling even more. I'm just taking whatever is left and just applying it in all the other spots I wouldn't mind glowing. Just adding some more Fix Plus is crucial when you're trying to get your glow on. To line my lips, I'm using my favorite NYX Cosmetics lip liner ever, Hot Cocoa. This one is the one especially when you're using lighter shades. The lip shade I'm using today is Morphe in the color Brunch. It kind of has like a peachy undertone to it. For a little bit of shine, I'm going in with my Jouer lip gloss in the color Mimosas. Mimosas and brunch, they just go together like it was so necessary. Time to lose this headband and do something with my hair. 
So this concludes the look, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe. Since you made it this far, go ahead and check out some of my other videos. They are linked at the end. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Mwah!